So did you watch the season finale of Survivor 40 Winners at War? The 20 year anniversary marked the first time awards actually went virtual. The sole survivor collected a record $2 million prize. So after a three hour finale, who is the winner over all the other previous winners? The winner of Survivor Winners at War, Tony. Yes, congratulations to Tony. He is joining us live this morning via Zoom to celebrate the win. Welcome, Tony Vlacos, and congratulations to you. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. So tell us, what was the trick to winning this time around? I mean, you're, you're playing against all these seasoned winners. Did you play differently this time than you did the first time uh, that you won? Oh, yeah, most definitely. Uh, this, the trick this time was to be patient and just to try to time the moves perfectly. Uh, I said in the first confession of this confessional of the season that I wanted to get everybody's guards to go down because going into the game, everybody's guards are way up here. They don't trust nothing you say. They don't believe a word that's coming out of your mouth. So the trick to that was to be patient enough to wait until their guards come down, and that's when I struck with my moves. Yeah, so much of it is a mental thing, and it's so interesting to watch as it unfolds on TV. Now, the other thing that was interesting is the ending last night was so different because you had to do it virtually. Tell us about that. Oh, yeah, I mean, the, you know, as, as beautiful as it is to have the grand finale with an audience clapping for you, cheering, standing ovations, booing you, or whatever the case may be, <laughs> you know, popping champagne, toasting everywhere, hugs, kisses, fans everywhere, as beautiful as that is, it cannot compete to sitting down in the living room, the comfort of my own home with my family to share that epic moment. That was just, you know, it's a, the most memorable thing ever in my life. And, I, and it was, oh, it was just so epic, so beautiful. And we love seeing the video there of you hugging your family when you, when you realize uh, that you won. It's fantastic. Hey, I want to ask you about Amber, uh, one of the other contestants on this show. Of course, she's married to Boston Rob. She is from our area. She grew up in Beaver County. So, of course, we were sort of rooting for her when this season began. But do you think they sort of had a disadvantage coming into this as a couple? I mean, was there a target on their back as far as strategy? You, you know what it is? Boston Rob has such a big name that uh, it was a disadvantage for that reason only because there was a lot. I mean, the theme of the, uh, the season was to get rid of the power couples. Uh, everybody that was a power couple, they, we, we tried to stop them right away. Me and Sarah snuck by that. Nobody seen that coming until the end. But Amber, she was, a, she was awesome. I, I wanted to work with Amber. I had a lot of great talks with Amber. Uh, she told me about how her daughters love astrology, and we were talking about the stars, and Fiji has plenty of stars to look at. So me and Amber, we talked a lot in the beginning, but when – you know, you all started that whole thing about, oh, we got to break up an alliance. We got to break up uh, Amber and them. You know, I had to go with the grain. I didn't want to vote her out. She was a great person. She was fun to be around. Great lady, you know, and I really enjoyed being with her those few first few days that she was there. Finally, tell us how Survivor has changed her life, because it really has, right? Um, Survivor changed my life financially. You know, I mean, obviously, you know, to win a million dollars the first time, it, you know, people have to save $1,000 a month for 50 years to get the amount of money I got in 39 days, you know, and just, I'm an average working person, you know, and there's no way I could have saved more than the money that Survivor gave me in my lifetime. So it was a blessing. I put a lot of down payments on buildings. I invested in real estate. And now with this time winning this time, I'm going to just pay off all those mortgages that I incurred from winning the first million dollars. <laughs> well, good. I'm glad you have a plan. And we just want to say congratulations, Tony. Well played. And we really enjoyed talking with you today. Thank you so much. Have a great day. You too. And stay tuned for a CBS virtual reunion show for the cast of Survivor 40. Those de details are still to come.